let's say you get a heavy rainstorm and you get a 50 or 100 year event. Well, now you go back and you're going to notice that there have been more changes made within two or three days than probably 20 years. And that kind of happened in Western North Carolina recently. Would yes. That, be an example? So that would definitely be an example. To find an equivalent level of geomorphic work done on that region of North Carolina, I believe we have to go back to 1960. And in 1916, there was uh, an anomalous extreme weather event. That was of an equivalent severity to what happened. The knee-jerk reaction to something like this among certain political factions is to blame this on you know, climate change, which has been redefined to exclude everything except for anthropogenic climate change. That's how it's, the, the narrative has been contrived in order to redefine the terms. If you'd have said climate change 25 years ago, you could be talking about a whole spectrum of things. And anybody who was in a conversation or reading a paper or whatever that said climate change, they wouldn't just be thinking carbon dioxide and green, greenhouse warming, right? They wouldn't be thinking about global warming. You'd have to be thinking about a bunch of things. You might be thinking about ocean currents. You might be thinking about volcanic eruptions, which can produce effects that can last for years. You might be looking at changes in solar radiation, which was always considered to be a possibility up until the 90s, the 1990s. And then what happened? Well, solar science kind of got sidelined, right, because the focus was on carbon dioxide. So the solar physicists and solar scientists are busy studying and learning a lot about the sun and realizing that the sun is a whole lot more dynamic than anybody had assumed a decade or two or three earlier. Although there were those who always were speculating and, and seemed to draw a direct connection between what the sun was doing up there and what was happening in the, in the world down here below in terms of climate change. All that got excluded, see, with the politicization of the climate change science, the climate change science, uh, it all became directed towards anthropogenic.